Hey folks, I'm going to be honest. I really never expected to make this video. When Trainer Zava said, uh, let's do a best of three for our putting our LCPGL teams up against each other, I thought, you're going to beat me in two rounds. There ain't going to be no round three. You are far and away the better LC player, and you did far, far better in the LCPGL tournament than I did. So, uh, even though statistically I should have expected to win about 1 in 3 or like 40% of my, of my matches against him, I just really didn't see even winning 1. So, and yet, round 1 I lost to Sleep Powder Miss, primarily. And round 2 I defeated him handily, so here we are at round 3 and I actually really like my odds of winning this match. I'm leaving my circuit at home uh, because I figured that he would expect the Sticky Web, and so instead I'm going with my three most competitive Pokémon, which are heterodyne, which, uh, you know, I'm thinking, okay, well, if he didn't bring either of his ground types, I could potentially clean up with this uh, Magnemite. Um, so here he leads off with his Yanma, so this is a good situation for me, good initial switch, uh, good initial matchup. He goes ahead and switches out into Wooper. I really should have gone for, um, I really should not have gone for the T-Bolt, I really should have gone for the Flash Cannon, but eh, oh well. So here I'm going to go ahead and switch out. I got into Kazulu, revealing that I brought the Tangela, and here I think the whole point of him bringing out Wooper was to bait me to see if I brought my Tangela. And so here he's back out into his Yanma, um, and he's going. I'm going to go ahead and withdraw because you know can't do uh, you know do not want to lose my Pokemon that early. Uh, so he goes ahead and protects. Safe move, obvious move. That's fine. Um, and here he goes for the U-turn, which is great because it's going to activate my Berry Juice. So um, I'm going to be back up to full health, and that means I will be able to take any hit, considering he doesn't have rocks on the field, yada yada yada. Um, I can also go for Recycle and get that Berry Juice back. So he goes ahead and withdraws his um, Yanma, goes back out into Wooper, and I figure, let's just go... So I go for the Flash Cannon, get some damage off onto Wooper. Uh, I'm not worried about him stockpiling because I have Tangela, 4x effective moves. I go ahead and recycle here just to see what he's going to do. I was thinking he might stockpile. Instead, he goes for the Ice Punch. Great move because it breaks my Sturdy. Um, and, you know, also could get the Freeze Hacks, but I didn't see that being particularly likely. Here I'm going to go out into Kazulu, hope that he doesn't predict the switch, um, and this is going to give me a chance to put something to sleep. So he goes for the Earthquake, um, trying to get that KO, uh, but no, it's not going to... I wasn't going to leave my Pokemon in. So here I figure whoever he switches out into um, is going to get put to sleep. So out he brings Sneasel, and I'm thinking, okay, great, that's a that's a sleeping Sneasel. And then I remember, oh wait, no, he's got the Lumberry. So now he's consumed his Lumberry. Um, but I'm actually okay with this because Tangela is such a physical wall that I think I can take hit. I'm actually not going to, I'm not going to try for it though. I'm going to go out into my own Sneasel because I figure the better move is to have the Sneasel out and go for the speed tie. So if I outspeed him, then I've won the match. Unfortunately, he outspeeds me and this is going to get a little bit more complicated. That's too bad. If basically, so if I had outsped him, then I could have uh, ice sharded uh, his Yanma and if I wouldn't have killed, I would have gotten it really close. Plus my, um, my Magnemite would have been able to clean up. So here he goes ahead and knocks off. That's fine. I don't care. Nutberry was not going to be useful in this match. I go ahead and put his Sneasel to sleep. And so now, this is still a really great situation for me. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and switch out because I want the Regenerator health back. I really do. And Heterodyne should be able to hit everyone on his team with Flash Cannon and do a decent chunk of damage. So he's going to withdraw Sneasel here. Fine by me. Totally fine. I figured he was going to go out onto Wooper. That's totally fine. Totally expected. At that range of health, Flash Cannon should be able to take it out in two hits. So... Boom, definitely going to take him out, and I am pretty sure I outspeed, I actually definitely outspeed because Wooper is slow as anything, and Magnemite, I think, is modest, fully invested in speed. So, Wooper is down, and I should be able to clean up with my, uh, with blah blah blah, um, with my Magnemite. So he goes ahead and U-turns, it's going to do, it's not going to quite get me down to Berry Juice activation range, which is unfortunate. Uh, it was a crit, though. Um, I had to switch it a little tiny, teeny, teeny, whiny, but more damage, but oh well. So, Sneeze is going to be back out, and I think I, I went for the T-Bolt here just to get maximum damage, and uh, I really should have gone for the Flash Cannon. I really should have. He gets the first turn wake and goes for the Brick Bake. Right, and so I had so many opportunities to win this match, but Hax screwed me over. I lost the speed tie, and then he got the first turn wake. If either of those had not happened, I would have won this match. Uh, Ice Shard is not going to kill me. It's just not. Uh, Kazulu has enough health 
to be able to take that. I went for the Ancient Power just in case he decided to switch out uh, so that he could have um, the fake out again. But no, uh, it doesn't work out. And so now his Yanma is going to be able to take me out with a Bug Buzz, an Air Slash, even a freaking U-turn at that range of health would probably KO. Um, so I'm sorry if I sound a little bit salty, Zabuza. You uh, statistically are the better player. Uh, I am really not holding it against you that you won these matches. I don't... It's maybe not completely fair to say that you won due to hacks. just felt a little bit that way in this precise moment. Um, but yeah, uh, they were three really good games, and I hope you folks enjoyed them as much as I did. Uh, comment, rate, subscribe, and challenge, folks. I will see you all probably next week. So long.